Packing has begun, you guys. I'm scared. <laughs> I don't know where to start. Hey guys, welcome. Welcome back to my channel. Welcome to, I cannot believe that we're filming this, a pack with me for my hen. I can't believe we're going. We're, it's literally Tuesday now and I'm going Thursday morning. Last night I rooted out like any bits that I thought I might want to bring and the suitcase is overflowing and I haven't even tried on some of the new bits that I got. Also, one dress that I really, really wanted and I only came back into stock on Saturday and I ordered it with next day delivery and I saw still not here and it's Tuesday and I wasn't going to be home tomorrow. I was just going to go straight to work and stay with my mom. so 10 of breaths will get delivered tomorrow and I won't be home. I might come back for it but I'm just like will I go all the way to Wicklow to get it I don't know anyway I don't really have any outfits like I actually have no nighttime outfits so I kind of need it like I actually have none I have none I have this jumpsuit behind me but like I can feel that I've put on weight if you get me I don't feel like it's gonna fit me because it didn't fit me last week when I was feeling skinny so I don't know. Anyway, no negative vibes around here, maybe it will fit, but I just feel like if I try it on tonight I won't even get it on, so then I'm like, why would I bring this huge jumpsuit with me if it doesn't even fit me? And that's another, that's my other main outfit, like, so I've got no nice, nice time outfits. <laughs> For my own party. Yep. You guessed it. Perfect, isn't it? <laughs> I'm just such a genius. I'm just popping on shame my hair, I adore it. Look, look at all that, the broken up highlights. I love it. My hair had got to like one colour at one point, so then I kind of let it grow out a bit and get a bit healthy because I feel like there was like breakage and stuff at the front. And I'm delighted that I did because it just looks much more natural. So good. So I got a full head of baby lights. I didn't have to get any low lights or anything like that, I think. When I went for my consultation, it wasn't in the place that I ended up going, it was in the craft. They were like, oh, like, we usually, we don't really recommend low lights. I feel like it just makes them look unnatural or something, like, that's what they said. <laughs> um, something along those lines, I can't remember exactly, but they just do, like, baby lights. I don't really know. I wasn't too sure how they did it. I don't understand how hairdressers do it. But, anyway. I got a full head of baby lights. I went to a different place that I couldn't get an appointment in time for the craft. Um, I went to Rome, Romina Daniels or Daniel in Sandyford. Honestly, I think I'll be going there from now on to be honest. So good. I got like my extensions done as well the other day. My hair by Lucy. I already told you that at the time I vlogged it. But like I got the ends cut then so I didn't even need that done. I just literally got like my little tiny bangs trimmed um, and then the colour done and they did like a toner um, and then a curly blow dry and it was like 126 euro which I think is really good for a salon nowadays but like really 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 good and the salon was so so nice like stunning inside had like a stunning coffee all of that i vlogged it for you see but there's like really nice treatment rooms and like the like seats that you sat in to get your hair dried your hair washed like massaged you it was really 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 nice i'm like hmm, i might see what i can get done there tomorrow <laughs> i'm not well I'm like what else can i get done before i go i just want everything done but i've got to find no time <laughs> um anyway yeah obsessed i really like it so happy and I'm also so happy that I found somewhere that I really like. You know what I do also have an Adina Ravi dress that I was going to keep for like day two of the wedding or something. But I might just have to wear it. You know? Okay so I think I'll start with doing like a bit of a haul of like stuff that I've picked up. Actually I didn't. No so it's new. I don't know if that's pointless. No I'll go through my penny stuff because they're all over the place I don't know what I'm bringing I haven't even tried them on so I'm gonna start with what I picked up in pennies first of all actually I'll show you what I got in duns because it's only one thing <laughs> so it just makes sense to get one thing ticked off so I got this skirt my mom actually got me a white denim jacket which was 
great thought because she was like thinking that I could wear it like in the evenings over my outfits or like to the airport and stuff but I just didn't like the fit it was just like it was more of a top I think it was actually nearly like a denim top it was quite nice but it just wasn't me if you get me I wanted to like it but I just I didn't and I was worried that I wouldn't wear it so I swapped it for this white skirt no, it's not white white it also needs a steam <laughs> um smells very like fakey or something it smells like a shop but it was 25 euro i got a 12. i haven't tried it on i'll try it on now but it's really nice quality my friend megan told me about a nice white satin type of skirt that she saw in Dunst, but i can't remember if it was this gallery one or not but i feel like it must have been this one it's not that white though so i'm not sure anyway let's try this Okay, I'm actually quite pleasantly surprised now. Obviously it needs an iron, but it's quite flattering because sometimes I feel like mm -hmm. satin skirts are the most flattering. Now, now I'm going to show you the bottom like. It's just so tough, but the room is so full of stuff that I literally can't move back. But it goes to like there. Sorry, this is criminal, a criminal haul. Oh my God, it might be cute with these shoes that I got. Like, like it's kind of plain, but I feel like with like, she's like that it might make it more exciting so i'm glad i got this now because it's a good option to have and i'll also definitely wear it like other times you know it's not like something that i can just wear once the only issue is i've literally got no idea what top to wear i have to have a look <laughs> i have some white crop tops i just don't know i feel like it needs to be styled really nicely to be nice enough for a hen my time outfit you know right let's go on to pennies now so i got these flip-flops i'm not a hundred percent sold but i think i'm like 95 percent sold they did have like plain white and stuff but i have got an, a plain white pair like they're not brand new so like you know the pennies ones are like a year i feel like you can't really not get a brand new pair every time you go away it's kind of just like you may as well i know that's so bad but then i saw these gold ones and i'm like all my outfits are going to be white like i am obviously going to wear some accessories and stuff that aren't white you know so i was like it might break up my outfits it might make them and these were 130 instead of one euro because they're coated in gold <laughs> so i felt like do you know what i'm gonna go for something different i think they're quite glam they make a normal comfy i love these flip-flops i feel like they're the most comfy ones the like cheap pennies ones and they're just like walking on a piece of sponge <laughs> so yeah i got them for 130 you literally cannot go wrong I think they're nice <laughs> I also obviously had to pick up some of these I actually didn't even pick up wipe on purpose but they go with literally all my outfits so well, there's stuff in here that I forgot that I got and I literally was only there the other day less than a week ago and um, I got some socks I've been needing ankle socks for so long so I'll put them with me because I don't know if it'll be boiling it's like gonna be in the 20s but might want to wear runners you know during the day i don't know i'm not i'm not sure but i'll definitely be wearing runners on my way there and my way back anyway so it's nice to have some nice to have some fresh socks and mine are all like really worn out at the moment you know when they get to that stage i got these mostly just because they were reduced to seven euro but i feel like you can't go wrong and they're a nice lower option now i might not be bringing these because you know i've already got about 20 other pairs of heels planned <laughs> so i don't know if i should but they're def like silver just goes with everything they go with my Zara bag that I've been using loads lately and I'll definitely get the wear them even if I only wear them once or twice it's not bad for seven year reduced from 18 I probably wouldn't pay 18 in pennies for them but they're really nice I really like the shape and stuff very glam but also not too high so you could wear them to like in between type of stuff uh what else do I get that isn't clothes because I'll try all the clothes at the end oh yeah I got some of these bra and knicker sets because I love them I'm not I can't remember if I liked the knickers or not but I love the bra I've been wearing the bra that I got of this forever I've got a medium I can't remember 100% if that's the size I got last time but I'm pretty sure and then I also just got a white because why not so good they're like seven euro each those sets um, oh, I got a bit of dry shampoo because I'm very low on dry shampoo at the moment. I've never tried the pennies one, but it's handy. I can't bring that, unfortunately, though, because it's too big to go in my luggage. And now we're on to clothes. We're going to have to start trying stuff on. I did get a bikini that I 
definitely not trying it on. Oh no, I obviously have to try it on, but I'm not trying it on on the camera, I don't think, because it's I just had dinner, you know. I'm not feeling it. I'm really not feeling it. It looks very small as well, it really does. Like I don't have big boobs or anything, but sorry, I don't know what's wrong with me. Um yeah, it's very small. So I'm not sure. I'll just will I just get it over with. I'll just try this one on first. Because it fits, but I just don't like it. I just think it makes my boobs look even smaller than they are. <laughs> like they're just like really, really small. <laughs> like do you know how some accentuate them and actually make you look like you have boobs? Like some are quite flattering. This one's definitely not. And the bottoms aren't bad, but I'm not. No, it looks like a little girl. <laughs> it doesn't look right. The bottoms, I've got my knickers on underneath, excuse them, but no, I just don't think so. Not the greatest, you know? See, I also already have two white bikinis that I think I liked. So I'll try them and hopefully they'll be nice. I also got a white swimsuit, so fingers crossed there's something. So the next thing that I have to try on is this little set. I'm not sure, like the quality is amazing. I'm just not sure if like I love white cycle shorts and a white crop top on me. Like it's not the most flattering. <laughs> if they're black I might be able to, so I'm not sure. But they're four euro each and the quality's so good. So I'd love to love them. They're kind of like ivory. They're not like white white as well. They're really nice. They're like ribbed and they're so soft. The quality is absolutely insane. Like fair play to pennies. I love the quality but they are see-through and the cycle shorts, I think the length of them is very unflattering but they're so see-through. They're nice quality but I'd need something covering like my whole body. Like if I wore them underneath the shirt or something but then like will you even see them at some point? <laughs> I don't know, I'm not loving them. I'm not feeling that body confidence at the moment guys that I'm going on the sun. It's not ideal. I really should have tried all this on in the morning and I'm feeling more comfortable confident but no I actually do do not mind it I feel like it might not look bad I'm gonna bring it as like a daytime option in case I need it because I don't really know what activities we're doing anyway and I can probably wear something over it it's not boiling at the moment there but like I actually don't mind how it looks it's mostly the fact it's so see-through <laughs> then unrelated but I got these like yoga pants they're a little bit loose on the waist but they're comfy though I don't know if I should swap them or not but they're really nice and they're a nice length because I got sheen ones and they are like really short <laughs> so they're at least a good length but I don't know if I should size down and you don't want them really tight on your legs either oh, it's tough isn't it why like why can't everything just fit <laughs> so annoying okay that's the end of the page okay so I'm um, like will I just show you like section by section what I'm thinking of bringing because a lot of it's new anyway and I'll just talk you through it. I think I will because we could be here all night otherwise. So let's just start with like glam outfits because I don't really have like plan plans for daytime. So I've shown you the skirt that I got in Dunn's. So that could be a possible thing that I'll be wearing now. I do have a few other options though. I think I might just bring like all of them up to my parents tomorrow and try them on then and ask my mum for advice. <laughs> But yeah, I've got these shoes that I literally am in love with, like, insane, they're Jimmy Choo vibes. Um, and these are like, god, 20 something euro on ASOS, and they're like satiny. I feel like you could definitely wear them as your actual wedding shoes, honestly, they're that nice. They're so nice. I love them. Stunning, because they all like make an outfit, that's the good thing. Like, they're really good and then I also have these white ones that I'm not sure if I'll bring but they're like a jeep I can't remember what designer do you know that kind of like toe <laughs> yeah these are also like a bridal type of ones on ASOS and these were so reasonable as well so we'll see if we need them I don't know if we will I'm obviously going to try cut down on the heels that I bring because they're heavy <laughs> um ooh, what else did I get these are all all ASOS to be honest Pretty much everything that I got is I wish my bloody ASOS dress would arrive. But um yeah, mostly I've got accessories and stuff organised, but that's a good thing because I can now dress up some of the um other bits that I have, like that skirt, like I've got this gorge hairband, it's so nice. Love that. And this bag as well, these are literally all from ASOS. 
which I think is so cute. I think it has a little chain inside. Yeah, it has a little chain. Oh, so cute. It has a little um, pearl strap. So that's like the sweetest thing I've ever seen. So I'm in love with that. And then I'm like, I might bring this. I'm not 100%, but I'm gonna have a look at what other bags I have. This is the only one I actually bought, but it could be cute. I can definitely wear that like a few times if I want. Um, and then another thing I got from ASOS, these are actually not that white. They kind of have like a pinkish hint off them, but that's fine. Like not everything needs to be white. I actually kind of wish I laid off it a bit to be honest. But yeah, I got these. I'm obsessed. Like I feel like they're even nicer on. Like the pointed toe is just really flattering. It makes your feet look slim and nice. But I just love them. I thought they'd be cool. I got like the dress that I ordered from ASOS that isn't here. Is like a big like kind of poofy one so i thought they'd be really cool with that kind of like ariana grande vibes but however and then other shoes i've got another pair in here that i've had for a while i've worn them to a wedding before but that's the only time i've worn them sorry let me just find them but so many pairs honestly when i look in here there's actually loads of other ones that i could wear but yeah i feel like these could be nice for the hem because they're a little bit different and they aren't just they're not white but like they will go with everything but they're so pretty and nice they're from asos back in the day back in the day like a year ago <laughs> they're so nice got little butterflies on them so i do love them i probably need a little wipe down i don't think i've wiped them since the wedding last year i'm just supposed to get that but they're just like little fairy shoes i just love them so much I'm like can i actually wear different pair of heels every night I don't need that much clothes, do I? Like, you only need a little skimpy, skimpy little bits. So I reckon I can't. <laughs> um, what else do I have that's new? So yeah, this is a swimsuit that I got from ASOS. I'll also have to try that on. It's just, I'll show you. fairly plain so it's kind of good because it'll definitely double as like a little bodysuit as well I feel like it's, and it'll just be handy like if I want to go for a swim in this even here over somewhere it's just a handy normal to have the back there so it scoops down a bit the back and then up the front so you just can't go wrong it's just a nice simple like kind of like bodysuit material like it's just that normal swimsuit material but yeah Great, so that's also from ASOS from the brand Brave Soul, which I don't think I've ever ordered from before, but looks really, really good. I'm, I've got high hopes for that one. I'm hoping that'll be a good staple um, to bring with me. Like, just throw on, do you know, that kind of way. You need a few bits like that. Like, there's always a few bits that you live in when you go away, let's be honest. Oh, I got this, not on ASOS for a change. They are from Amazon. I think they're so cute there. <laughs> like dupes of the Van Cleef ones. That's a bracelet. And this is a necklace. Actually, I really need to remember to bring like jewellery with me because the image of me to forget it. That's a necklace, so sweet. They also had matching earrings, but I didn't get them. Um, oh, I'll probably just wear gold earrings or something. And now are we done with all the new stuff? We might be. I've got lots of bits around, like I've got this hairband that I got years ago, but it's actually perfect. I literally came across it, so I'll bring that as an accessory. This is the Nadine Marabi jumpsuit that I was telling you about. Now, I'm dying to wear this since I literally got it months ago. They kind of gifted me it and a dress, and I nearly collapsed and died because I'm obsessed with them. But it's incredible, it's just a little bit small. And I don't know if it's just me being paranoid because I'm on my own and I don't want to zip it up and ruin it, but isn't that just magical? Oh my god, there's no one else I'm going to wear it unless I wear it to like day two of the wedding, but I already kind of know what I want to wear for them. So I don't know if I'll get a chance. And then the bottom is just like white flares. So I'm going to, I'll bring that up tomorrow and see if my mum can zip me into it. And that will hopefully make up my mind. Oh, yeah. My goodness. <laughs> what am I like in this unorganized head in the whole entire world? Okay. I think I'm going to have to bring steamer or I'm going to have to do 
Let's see you tomorrow. Oh, that much for the steamer. Tomorrow night you do all that type of stuff. And yeah, I don't know if, if I should bring the dress or not. I might bring the dress as a backup because I want to have really, really nice outfits. Let's be honest. It's my hen. Like, I can get something else. I can get something else for day two if I have to. So. I would have shown you this as well when I first got it. The other movie where everything. So it's a dress. It's gorgeous. I might be able to do it too much justice anyway from here. But it's beautiful. And like I said, I don't, is it too nice? Like, no, I don't know. It isn't. It's got a big bow on the back and then it has puff sleeves. It's fab. I'm obsessed with it. Like, these dresses are like... I don't know exactly, but the Nadine Marabi stuff is like around 400 euro. For an outfit, so do I want to wear 800 euro with outfits on my head? Like, or are they not more like wedding? Like, they're obviously good enough for your wedding, you know? I don't know. I don't know, but anyway, the options there, so I can do that. These are my wedding pajamas, so I repeat, we're bringing them. It'll be too warm pajamas, probably. I need to remember to bring pajamas actually. And then I've got such random bits now. Like I don't think I've got anything new. Like I've got loads of these like little little blow up donut things. I've got like ten of them. I've got all different fruits and everything <laughs> in here. I literally have look all of these. So perfect. And um, I'm gonna bring them for the girls. I can just blow them up and leave them in the pool got this little beach bag that I got on Sheen when I went away the summer before last. We didn't go away last summer. I've just been saving for the wedding, but this is handy because it's actually quite decent. Like, I know it's not, it's not huge, but like, it fits everything you need for the beach, you know? Remember I used to like pile, believe it or not, me and Com's towels in here and all. Like, actually that reminds me, I need to bring a beach towel. I see one over there. Um, okay. Perfect, and then I'm gonna bring my denim jacket because you just can't go wrong for throwing it on over stuff. It's so handy. It's just a cropped light denim one. Definitely going in my basket. Um, and then I've got a few other bits that I need to decide on whether I should bring them and they all need to be ironed. Oh, another fun accessory that I've got is this like water foam thing. I'm bringing that. And another one of these <laughs> I just came across. Oh, will definitely come with me. It's like beach cover up. It's not that great. I think I'll leave that one. I've got this one that's like a shirt, but it's a beach cover up, and I think that'll be a bit of me. So I'm gonna bring that because it's very handy. You know, got this in pennies a good few years ago. In large, and it's great. It's just yeah, it's very wrinkly. It's that kind of fabric that really just gets wrinkled. So yeah, but it also doesn't look that bad when it's wrinkled. So it's not actually the end of the world if you get me. It's kind of chilled, but. A great one i'm gonna bring that this i'm unsure whether i'll bother with or not but i got this on cup she it is it's actually really nice though for over like your togs i don't know if it's gonna be that hot though that i need that like i can probably just wear shorts Look, actually i need to find my shorts where are my good denim shorts oh, i bet you they're in with all my normal clothes like these are all with my summer clothes and i bet you it's bloody buried my jeans and stuff anyway i'm gonna have to look for them because they're absolutely a staple <laughs> these are just a comfy pair of shorts i feel like you can't need them for running around in maybe even sleeping in then just bring some like pajama shorts and t-shirts as my pajamas because it's gonna be way too hot but yeah they're so handy oh i've actually got this other swimsuit that i got in pennies a couple of years ago but it's so nice it's like ribbed kind of style really nice so I may, I'll try it on and see if I like it because I can't remember, to be honest. Um, and then while we're on the topic, I've got a few white bikinis here that I've already got and I just need to decide what to bring. This is a swimsuit that I doubt I'll be bringing because I'd say that ASOS one will be nicer. I'm not sure though. So yet again, I probably should try it on. It's back at 10 o'clock at night and my bedtime is 9 o'clock at night, so not really in the mood. This one's a good handy one. I feel like it really is quite flattering. This is from Miss Guided a couple of years ago. 
but it's really nice on it's just that real simple and i feel like that suits me i don't have massive boobs but they're not tiny either but like yeah i just feel like that helps it's just flattering do you know what i mean and then that's the bottoms there they're quite skimpy though but sure look what can i do have another pair here as well but they're also quite grumpy so what can i do about it this one is sheen these are the bottoms and then this is the top but i just don't know i feel like the boob is a bit far away i guess i can't remember i don't know if i've ever worn this <laughs> or not so it's another one i'll be trying on this is a white little sarong thing so i'll probably bring that to go over my bikinis and then i've got this white dress that's just like a handy one that you can throw on so i'm debating bring bringing it but it's actually heavier than you think this is from asos like last summer i think but just that like brodery brodery whoever you pronounce that um that's really nice it's a handy little one to have that kind of still looks nice so i'll definitely put them in the pile but i'm not 100 percent sure if i'll bring it up but anyway probably bring it to my mom's <laughs> and decide there so yeah i probably just need to get trying on some bits and making decisions i need to like i need to do my tan tomorrow night i don't think i'll bother doing it tonight i'll just do it the night before i don't think i need two nights do i i'm so not bothered <laughs> so many tasks oh, and i still have this thing can work it's so selfish Oh, and then for my, like, other little bag that I can bring and put under the, the seat in front of me. got this from Deals. It's so good because they're, like, exactly the right size for the ones that you can bring. So I've got this and then I've got my 10kg suitcase. I'm also bringing, I obviously checked that in. I got Priority and this bag. I think it was around 30 euro for there and back. Actually, that sounds really good. I don't know if it was that good. It was under 50 anyway, defo. But worth it because I have so much to bring. So, yeah, I think a few of the girls did that as well. I think most people actually did that. Just got priority because you get to choose your seat as well. So we all get to sit together. Because if you're like particularly like go to the hang, you want to sit together. I think we're just on a, yeah, right there. So you have to pay to pick your seat. So we've got to pick our seats and get in the priority queue and bring a bag for that so it's worth it i forgot to show you my is there anything i'm not supposed to look at in the hot press while you're cleaning it no it's just clothes but it's, there's nothing wedding, in it really like stuff, no? that's all wedding stuff yeah so just don't look inside it well you can look at it like it's not my wedding dress yeah they're all just bits like oh these are so dry yeah i forgot to show you my outfit well this was in my sheen haul if you watched that but it's literally just like a top and leggings from sheen but they're quite nice. Well, to be honest, I don't even know if I want to wear them, but I kind of have nothing else now, so I'm just going to bring them. I'm just going to have to wear them, <laughs> whether I feel comfortable in them or not, but what can you do? So, that's grand. I don't know what shoes to wear. I might just bring my white Air Force, because you just can't really go wrong. Oof. Or do I want something else? I suppose you can't go wrong with Air Force like when you're over there and stuff they're just a like classic or should I bring something else I'm kind of bored of all my shoes at the moment I don't really have anything new so I don't know what to bring yeah go on I'm just gonna bring that um, and then oh I just remembered that I have to decide on my liquids I'm gonna fill them up tomorrow as well like I can't be doing it now but I've got, I think I'm going to bring this perfume. I don't actually know what size it is because it doesn't say, but it's quite small. I could say that's only 50 mils. But it's nice summer vibes. It's very like orangey kind of. It's so nice. It's Marc Jacobs, ever so fresh. And I adore it. I feel like it's the perfect one for like a broad. And then I have this skin ingredient. Well, actually, I don't even know if I've got any sun cream. I need to have a look, but anyway. <laughs> I'll just get it tomorrow if I need it. But this is oh well everyone knows about this. I haven't I've only used it once. So I think <coughs> I 
I think I got perfume up my nose. But it is um, SPF 50 and it's for your face. It's meant to be unreal. So I'm going to bring this because it's only 73 mils. This is handy. I don't have to put it into anything. And then in this, I'll probably just do like moisturiser. I don't know if I'll bring tan or not. I'm kind of undecided. I don't even know what tan to actually do. I did get a new medium, just be bold. It's just feel like dark and ultra dark come off so quickly and so easily, but I'm not sure. But I need to bring my tan with me because I'm going to do that tomorrow night. And I need to decide what other bits I'm bringing. Like, oh my God, I need to decide on my makeup. Like, oh, why am I like this? I'm just gonna put some of my NARS sheer glow in that. I think I'll just bring that. And then, so yeah, that's my foundation. And then all the other bits are just bits. I don't think I'll need to put any other liquids in. I will have a fit them. Yeah, moisturizer and tan, and maybe some sun cream if I have it. Maybe my mom will even have some. I can just put in one of these. I'll sort it tomorrow. Oh yeah, I also have another night to make it that I completely forgot to show you. And I'm actually hoping that it's over here. I don't know if it is though, the shorts definitely are. Yeah. Mm. Is that it? Yeah, this is it. So I showed you this like months and months ago. I bought it ages ago and it's actually still on ASOS in case you want it. It's from the brand St. Genie's and it's a dupe of the um, Ninja Murabi suit that they do where it has these like pearls all the way down the shoulder and sleeves and um, they do like flared trousers with it but this is shorts and this is kind of like a fitted blazer it's not like an oversized one so I wore the shorts with an oversized plain blazer when we went to our tasting but um, they actually go underneath that even though you can barely see the shorts because it's like you're meant to wear clothes well you could wear it open but I think it's so we're supposed to be closed. So I have that outfit. I might just bring um I've got a, just a plain white flower bodysuit that will go well underneath it. I wish I've got this really nice top but I can see a stain on the back of it now. I don't know why that happens, it's just got some black run into it. It's so annoying. But yeah, this is so nice, so I might just bring that. Because it will go a couple of things, I'll even be able to wear that during the day. So Okay, there's another night I may have fit and uh, hopefully this jumpsuit will fit me. And then I've got those two. What's the other one? Oh yeah, the dress that I ordered. But if not, I might just wear that other Lady Murabi one, so we might be okay. I think that is the worst fit now. Like I just need to get stuff a bit more organised now. I'm probably just gonna throw most of it in bags and bring it with me tomorrow because I feel like I can't think straight at the moment I need a good night's sleep and I'll have way more time tomorrow. I already shared these in my birthday vlog but I'm gonna definitely pack them with me. My brother got me these for the hen. So cute. They're disposable cameras. They're such a rip off nowadays so I was gonna get them for the wedding but I feel like I'm definitely gonna bring the two of them. So I just bring one but not I'll just bring the two because it'll be nice I'll give one to the girls to use between them or something. Um, and then he also got me this little album to go with so I can put all the pictures in it which is so cute and oh I've got these little clips that I'm going to bring for when I'm styling my hair and then I've got these <laughs> sunglasses that we all made our little bridesmaids night a while ago. So I'll definitely be wearing them, they're so fun. Adore, actually I need to text the girls to remind them to bring theirs. Put on my stuff for tomorrow, there's my suitcase. My gym bag. My other big outfits, I don't know what I'm gonna do with them. If I do bring um, all my products now, like some of my tan and stuff that I'm only gonna use tomorrow, my handbag, and then I'm not bringing my handbag with me that's just for like work tomorrow and then this is my hand luggage I haven't even tried to they actually will fit in no worries but they're mostly bits that I need to fold or like bits for other people and stuff so I think I've got 
everything, but I really don't know if I do. <laughs> it's the next evening now in a mama parent's house. I'm in my brother's room in case you're like, what? <laughs> but um, yeah, I steamed all my stuff that needed to be steamed, I hope anyway. And I'm gonna just finish packing now. Oh my God, guys, of course my ASOS package that I was telling you about came today, so I drove down to Wicklow to get it. <laughs> earlier so better be nice but it's been worth it let's see hmm it's like sparkly it's chiffon kind of fabric i hope it fits i'm sure it will they're like it's kind of safe enough and i went like safe enough size as well it's just like yeah, mm, it's nice, it's really nice. Once it fits, it's a bit goofy. Oh god, it needs like a steam. I'll just like hang it up or something when I get there and it should be okay. I think it's fine. But I'm gonna wear that with my big like platform shoes for like the main night, I think. Now that ties in the bow in the back, I think. Let's try it on and see if it fits. Okay, it's literally perfect. There's a little bit more of the zip to go up, so it'll be a better fit up here when that's up, but I just cannot reach it. It's like kind of stuck and it's just like an awkward angle for me to do it, but so we'll also be able to fit it more easily, you know what I mean? It's just, the zip is like stuck. Um, and then yeah, this size no but I'm too lazy to do it right now, but I love it. It's huge. Now I need to slide on a pair of denim shorts to bring, so this is the first pair. So I'm kind of weird about the fit around here, but I don't mind them. They're not as short as I thought they'd be. Okay, I just looked at them in the mirror. These are now, there's too much material here or something. I loved these ones when I brought them away two years ago. They're a bit loose, but also like they're kind of, kind of meant to be baggy, are they not, you know? I like them. These are just from Sheen. Actually, the first ones are trying to wear PLT as well, by the way. But I like these. They're kind of like longer ones, you know? And then these ones are from Reclaimed Vintage on Instagram. And they're very comfy. I don't know if I like the wash as much. I think I prefer the slightly wider or slightly lighter wash. These ones are good though because they're like shorts, but they're not too short. But you can also make them shorter so easily, like just roll them up further because they're already rolled at the end. So you can kind of wear them however you want. None of them are like the perfect fit. Like I really feel like I need a new pair of shorts, but it's a bit late now. Right guys, I'm all packed up and ready to go. I just decided to use the beach bag that I'm bringing. I actually got a different one. It's not the one I showed you yesterday from the one. Um, I'm just going to use that as my bag, my little cabin bag. It's pretty much the same size as the one I was going to use. Uh, and then my suitcase is on so you can see it. It's like a bit more open here. It's sort like, of get lots of clothes. Tough. I hope it doesn't bust open. But anyway, <laughs> it fits and that's all that matters. I think I'm pretty much ready to go. I'm going to have to have my hair up because otherwise I'll get tan all in it and it's so like light. I did a different vlog for like getting prepped. I think I might have because this is more like a pack of me. So I don't know, I'm all over the place. I haven't started any editing so I don't know what's going on. But yeah, I'm gonna head to bed and I'll see you guys in the morning. I'm gonna start a new video in the morning. I'll do a vlog. So yeah, I'll have to love you and leave you here. Um, I hope you enjoyed. I'll see you in the next one. Bye. Next time you see me, I will be getting up for in the airport. I'll be going on my head anyway. <laughs>